Hey Tankers, Bonsai Duck here. Today we have 19 Mayhem 68, better known as Mayhem, from the 1SOB clan. He is platooned with Eugene Tackleberry, I think, um, and Fading Life. Um, also from the 1SOB clan and Toma. Um, he's in his Amex 1357. He's on Malinovka in a standard battle in a tier 7, tier 6 game, so top tier light. Uh, you know, we know eight shot uh, ra raging uh, French light autoloader. <laughs> um, not a very accurate gun at times. I mean, if you let it zoom in, it, it'll be it'll be accurate. But you'll uh, out of the uh, eight shots, you probably get about a mm, fifty to seventy five percent hit hit return on the eight shots usually. Anyway, Mayhem has spawned over on the west side, and uh, I think he's headed right towards a favored bush. Getting up into the bush, and uh, this is just a, I mean, it's a classic light start. Get some spotting, and he's lighting up a lot of car, a lot of, a lot of tanks. Hopefully his team can uh, do some damage. This that That's the one bad thing about this spot, is if you get over here and you start lighting stuff up and your team doesn't do anything with it. And uh, that seems to be the case. <laughs> All right, now we're starting to see some damage. Super Chaffee over there. I mean, there's a lot of highly uh, camouflaged, good visibility tanks in this game, and that uh, I mean, it, it, this is a uh, a spotter's paradise. Oh, oh, yes, the super chaffy is taking some aggro. Looks like we got Fading Life in the Tiger P and Eugene Tackleberry is in the uh, Scorpion. I'm assuming that's the Little Scorpion. Obviously, it's not Tier 8. Duh. All right. There's an E25 right there. Oh, St. Emil, Stuart Emil. And your, uh, your other lights have gone up to the hill and seem to be posing some good pressure up there. You got a Skoda T25 that's moved across the, the waterway over there. Uh, so you guys are you're doing quite well. Telling the T25 to fall back. He's in a position where he really can't. I mean, because if he moves across there, he might get spotted again. Um, it's, it's tough at that point. That's a that's an all or nothing play over there. There goes the E25. And taken out by Artie. Nice shot. Oh, the KV2. That was a KV2. I thought it was the arc of that <laughs> made me think it was Artie. All right, T25 is he's screaming for help now. Now again, you put yourself in that oh don't yep, then watch out for the super chaffy. Four to one game. Your heavies are battling it up on the hill, but they seem to have the lower ground on the hill as opposed to the upper, the higher ground, I should say. Oh. Uh, Super Chaffee's moving in, trying to light stuff up over there. Comes the T25 too. Oh, come on, guys. Come on. There you go. Yes. He's melting. He's melting. Oh. Goodness gracious. Missed twice. You need to 
He needs to die here soon or you're going to miss your opportunity. Okay. I think you could take a shot, finish him without being seen. Alright, I would say that the spotting in this spot may be trying, maybe drying up a little bit. 36 1 destroys the Tiger 1. Gene Tackleberry is over there. KB2 takes a shot at something. And your Black Prince is all alone up there. There goes Fading Life. And they have brought this back to a 6-4 to four game. You guys are going to be on your heels here pretty soon. It might be worthwhile to relocate and uh, see if you can do some other spotting. And there he goes. He's on his way. It's super chaffy. I mean, I like I said, I think you could have taken a shot at him and put him out of the game. You might have got it. You might have got spotted, but I think it, it would have been. It may have been worthwhile, at least in my opinion. This is your game. All right, so Mayhem is moving over to the west. Now he seems to be heading north. <laughs> what would seem to be west to me is actually north on this map, I guess. I don't know. See if he can spot these guys coming down the hill. Okay, he's got some spotting. Now maybe you can get some. There you go. Now they're receiving some damage. Nobody was spotting them before. Now they know they're in trouble. They got to make that move. They got to get down there. Oh. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's going to get you lit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And he's down, yeah. Run and hide, run and hide. <laughs> the engine is smoking and the antenna is broken and you got, wow. Okay. Okay. All right, you've disappeared. I think you can... Maybe head back up there and give him some eyes. Don't... F uh, your engine's still broken. Okay, use your repair kit. There you go. Now, get back up there and give him some eyes. At least the super chaffy got taken out during that exchange. <laughs> All right, we got the KB2 and the Scorpion. Just need some, some visibility, need some eyesight. That's what you're, there you go. You moved into a nice little bush. There's an AMX M445 up there somewhere. I got to quit leaning forward. I keep telling myself that. I need a strap that won't let me pull forward. <laughs> What do they got out there? The M445, the Stuart Mill, the T25-2, the OI Type 64. Type 64 is the dangerous one. The other guys, you'll spot them before they spot you. The Type 64. Hmm. He's over there by taking on your AT8 along with the OI. There's nothing you can do about that. You can't do anything about it. It's it's over. The Scorpion looks like uh, Eugene Tackleberry's moving over there to give him some support. And, oh, the AT-8 takes him out. Oh, there you go. There you go. Took him out. Nicely done. No six cents. Oh, he's in behind you. He's in behind you. Revolution. AT-8's taken out. Oh, the oh, I got the AT-8. All right. 
Oh no. We saw this in another video that you had. <laughs> where the heavy camped up against that building. Now, how did you how did you flush that out in that video? Yeah, looks like you you remembered. Mm, well, okay. Thought you did. <laughs> And we're loading the AP on a reload. Two heavies and two already. <clears throat> At this point, since he's on this side of the building, wouldn't it be better, uh, you know, just for future reference, wouldn't it be better to go over here where you can spot him? I'm just thinking. Scorpion's... There's Eugene. How did Eugene make it through that thing? Was a hundred, still at a hundred percent? All right, so we're moving in close. Maybe we can proxy light this guy. One, and he's down. Nice drive by. All right, that leaves the Artie. It's time to find him. Run away! AMX 13F3 and the M44. Two big, hard, two, uh, kind of hard hitting already. There's the M44. One, he's saluting. He knows it's over. Yep, he's down. Okay, now it's the AMX 13F3. Where's he at? We're reloading. Loading, loading, loading. How to find the RD. All right. Uh, for those of you who might remember, that was the Rawhide song. <laughs> All right. We're looking in the usual places. Now, the F... Uh, you know, the F-13 F-3, or the, the, yeah, the 13 F-3, I mean, it's a fairly quick... I mean, it's, it's, it moves along pretty good. So it could be well on its way somewhere else. And there he is. He's trying. Anyway, he's taken out. And that is a victory. All right. Well, you got an ace tanker out of that. You got a spotter, sharpshooter, fire for effect, and a patrol duty. 167,825 in credits, 3,236 in experience. He did 1,199 in damage, got three kills for a base XP of 1,598. He fired 16 shots. Of those 16, they hit, but of those 16 that hit, only 15 penetrated. So that's, that is good grouping for that gun, honestly. He did 315 from 300 meters out, and look at that spot. Look at that assistance damage, 5,192. Nicely done. I right, made some good credits, made some good experience. I know I had some comments in there that may, you know, I thought maybe you were being a little um, passive. Maybe you could have changed your position a little bit, but it looks like it worked out well for you, and, and, you, and you did a you, you did a really good job. So I uh, was able to um, you know get some some good assistance in there. So that's 19 Mayhem 68 from the one SOB clan in his AMX 1357 on Malinovka in a standard battle. If you like the video, hit the like button. Keep those videos coming. I greatly appreciate it. Please remember to hit the subscribe button. This is Bonsai Duck out.